The recent shooting of Jacob Blake in Kenosha, Wisconsin has reminded us that sports is secondary to matters of social injustice. Around the world, the NBA players held out of playoff games. MLS canceled matches as well yesterday, marking a historic moment for sports in an attempt to enact real change. CPL players will be showing their solidarity today. So we sent you to the field at UPEI early ahead of Ottawa's match with Cavalry. Adam Jenkins will have the call. Nothing has been normal about 2020, and that might be the understatement of 2020. A global pandemic that has forced the world to readjust and reconsider what's actually important. How we work, how we interact with one another, and what is essential to our lives from the frontline workers, our healthcare professionals, and unfortunately and unthinkably, even still in our society today, how we treat each other. Throughout the year, we have seen constant, constant and continuous instances of police brutality and blatant and abhorrent racism that still inundates our daily lives. Today, the players, coaches, and staff of the Canadian Premier League are making their voices heard. Black lives matter. And together, they mourn and demand change to ensure that message is heard loud and clear. After the senseless shooting of Jacob Blake in Kenosha, Wisconsin, another name in a list that includes heinous acts of violence, such as George Floyd and Breonna Taylor. Quite frankly, we could fill this entire match broadcast with the victims. The players have decided to band together to use their platform of professional athletes on a global stage, once again, to make sure that message is loud and clear. So as the players and staff of both Cavalry and Ottawa enter the pitch, each player standing side by side, team colors don't matter right now. Only one shirt matters on the pitch, and that is the black shirt that says quite clearly, Black Lives Matter. We are seeing the players stand together in a circle around center. And the other six teams in the CPL Powerful pictures and a united front as all players kneel 
many raising a fist during the national anthem. And now, while the two teams get set to kick off, Atletico Ottawa and Cavalry, the remaining seven groups, the other six teams in the Canadian Premier League, as well as the Canada Soccer referees, well, they're not going to leave the pitch. They will stand with arms linked around the perimeter of the field. We're being told for eight minutes and 46 seconds. Marcotte checks her watch. Farsi sends it over the line. All the players trying to remind each other of what's to come. Miriam Marcotte reminding everyone what's really important right now. Players have stepped back onto the pitch into a kneel for another minute and a moment of reflection for us all as we watch on. 